This is Lenny Farley, Purdue University Extension Forester. Now let's ID that tree. On this edition of ID That Tree, we're going to introduce you to flowering dogwood. Flowering dogwood is one of our most attractive small trees here in Indiana with beautiful white spring blossoms and very attractive fall red to maroon foliage. Flowering dogwood, like many members of the dogwood family, has opposite leaf arrangement. So the simple leaves originate directly opposite each other on the twigs. The leaves are simple, a single leaf blade. And they have an interesting venation pattern in the leaf where the veins running off the midrib angle and kind of sweep along the edges of the leaf. The leaf pattern, in addition to being opposite on flowering dogwood, also had a tendency for the outer twigs to arch up somewhat, giving almost a pagoda type look to the tree. This can also be found in some of our other dogwoods and sassafras. As we mentioned, flowering dogwood flowers very beautifully in the spring and ultimately will produce this cluster of fruit that will turn red in the fall and is eaten by birds and the seeds are spread to produce new dogwood plants. The bark on flowering dogwood is a rough alligator hide texture and a light to medium gray. Flowering dogwood, as we mentioned, is a very popular landscape plant because of its beautiful spring blossoms and great fall foliage. You typically need to be careful where you plant it. It likes good soil drainage, and it also can tolerate some shade and likes some protection from the wind as well. But put in the right place, flowering dogwood is a fantastic addition to your yard, as well as being an important understory tree in our native Indiana forests.